Baby, I'm holding Shorty, you gon' be left with your heart broke Your friends think I'm gorgeous, feel like an artist Time to get sold in an all show I pulled up the last five nights Calling my Ubers like usual, huh? Girl, get a clue, you read a room You the next boatload of cargo, huh? Watch me Let's go ahead and take a look of the new legendary and mythical weapons for a rank card that was added in the earlier update. Now once again, I'm gonna be giving away true Hogyoku in this video. It's very simple. All you guys gotta do is just comment down your Discord username down below so that I will be able to contact you and then hit the subscribe and like button right there. I'll be checking them one by one, so go ahead and follow those rules. So yeah, I wish you guys good luck. Now first of all, let's take a look of the new mythical weapon that was added yesterday, which is called the Hollow Burden right here. Now yes, this is the mythical 0.5% new Arankar weapon that was added earlier today. And as you guys can see, this is how it looks like. Yes, it does look like that you're holding a spear and then this sword at the same time. So yeah, I, I have a feeling that the spear actually looks like a reskin to me. I mean, that definitely looks like the, you know, the spear from Shinigami one, but you know, they just added some pointy stuff right there. But you know, the sword actually looks dope so yeah i'm gonna lie so yeah so as you guys can see right there this is how it looks like and yep we're gonna be taking a look of the m1s and pretty much the critical attack for this one all right so yeah pretty much let's go ahead and take a look and this is how it looks like so now let's go ahead and take a look of the sword how it looks like and how it works now for the m1 this is how it looks like there you go it looks so cool though but you know um i thought that you know it was actually the m1 effects of the sword but it's not it was actually the mortal ties i thought they added some kind of effects um you know like the what do you call this the previous uh, legendary blade that they added for around cars because the heavy attack actually looks amazing but right here uh this one is the heavy attack for it as you guys can see there's a critical attack so pretty much it will proc um you know a leap type of attack when it hits someone this is how it looks like so pretty much there you go so if it hits someone, it will actually do a backward leap and then at the same time, it will forward slash you like that one. So yeah, that missed. So that's why it didn't proc. So pretty much if it does this and boom, and then it leaps. So yeah, that's how it looks like fully. Now this is actually kind of mid, I ain't gonna lie. So if you're trying to uh, roll for this medical one, so I don't know what you guys think about this, but in my opinion, this is actually kind of mid mythical weapon. So I guess it's not really that worth to get this, but you know, it does definitely have the, um, you know, the aesthetic right here. It looks definitely awesome coming right up with the next one right here is called the caliber and it is a legendary dual gun type of weapon so as you guys can see now this one in my opinion does look better uh, than the new mythical one because the new mythical one actually looks a bit rush I mean it's just a reskin of the spear and then pretty much the Fakion of the Quincy weapon but right here this one is pretty new and as you guys can see and this is the M1 effects right here as you guys can see it definitely does have that you know thing right there that it looks awesome so yep as you can see you're just gonna be taking a look right here so yep that's the m1 right there let me know what you guys think down below i mean this definitely does look awesome in my eyes but yep so yeah i sound like a bit biased but yeah it does look cool right so yeah that's the heavy right there and the heavy attack i ain't gonna lie with this weapon actually it's so long range bro i mean take a look at that that is so far bro so yeah so if you like pvp and stuff this is definitely useful i mean take a look at that range and yeah here's some few things that you guys need to know about the crit as well so if you get hit with a crit it will actually put you in a ragdoll there you go which means it can be very good and be useful for combo extending uh type of stuff so yep take a look at that Boom. look at that ragdoll so yeah this is definitely worth to get than the new mythical one i mean just my opinion Anyways, that's pretty much in this video. It's a very quick one right there. And let me know which one is your favorite between these two. And if you don't like any of those, then you might as well want to save your rerolls and wait for the next update because I hear the next update is going to be big. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Make sure to leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe. Turn that post notification bell on for more awesome videos like this. So as always, thank you for watching and see you in the next video. Peace out.